there's nothing fun in losing. And I don't think it's okay to just be okay with a loss, right? Like that's not the culture I want to be a part of. So it's okay to be upset about it. But at the same time too, the longer you hold on to a loss, and this is something I had to learn as a young athlete, and I didn't get past this hurdle until later in my career, but sometimes a loss would stay with me for a week. How was that helping? Right? Like at the end of the day, the things that happened yesterday, if we're still holding on to that, how is that getting us better today? The only way that we're going to get better is we use that as fire and fuel to get better today. But if we're constantly harping on the things that we failed at, we're constantly harping on the losses, even if we're constantly harping on the wins, how is that motivating us to get better at the things, habits, dreams, goals that we need to today? Because after a certain point, you just start moping. And after a certain point, like, how is that getting you better? And and it's okay. Like, it's okay to be pissed. It's okay to be angry. It's okay to be frustrated. As long as we use that turmoil in a positive direction reflect what were the mistakes that you made how could you change them what could you do differently what could you do better what are aois that you identified during this game that i'm not going to allow to happen next game the only way that we can grow is by learning from our mistakes but what good does it do to make a mistake harp on it for a week but i do nothing to change it yeah